You're behind, you're in the driver's seat right now. Dude, because you guys keep bringing me in court and harassing me when I- This is like the 10th <laughs> and you're vaping in for 10 years, I finally got my license. Things should change with you guys. I'm still in court even though I- <laughs> And so, oh, we got one more. On the Motorola Moto, we're gonna take yourself off mute. Tell me your name, please. Is that good? And what's, yep, what's your name? Uh, Dustin, Dustin Reed. Okay. Mr. Reed, this is suspended up, so I'm going to read it to you. It says that on or about September 30th of this year on 54th Street there in Lee Township, that you are driving while license suspended. That is a misdemeanor. It's punishable by up to 93 days in jail and or $500 fines and costs. Understanding that charge, do you wish to enter a plea of guilty or not guilty to that charge at this time? Not guilty. And should you go all the way to trial? Are you looking to have trial in front of a jury or in front of a judge? Jury. You can go ahead and uh, continue to represent yourself free of charge like you are today, or you could always hire an attorney. I will give you a PR bond on this because you're not standing in front of me. If you were in front of me, you would not get a PR bond. You'd be sitting in jail between your court dates. Uh, and you're... Actually, you're behind, you're in the driver's seat right now. I have, a I have a license. I, 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 had my license. I had my license the next day after that. The only reason it got suspended was due to an insurance issue. I literally got my license within 24 hours of getting that ticket, man. And you already have a subsequent offense on October 9th. What do you mean? The driving on a restricted? Yes. That that that's because you that's because the cops don't know what they're doing. The only restriction right. I have is that so I have you don't have a PR bond. You have a cash surety bond, sir. What you need to do now is come in and post your cash surety bond. I don't have money, yeah. sir. So, I mean, I guess you got to put a warrant out. Well, then, I, 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 yes, I, and that's what we'll do, sir. You have a warrant out. Why why did you do me like that? Like I literally have a law. <laughs> and you're doing me like this. Like, I had a license when I got restricted. The only restriction is that I must have obtained you want me SR22 to read insurance, your but it does not say list of prior violations to tell you and why that, I'm doing you like this. And that's what I'm talking about is I haven't had a license in over a decade and I finally get my license. You're going to give me a, a, a warrant. Are you serious? I finally, I finally spent 10 grand and spent two years to get my license. And you're going to give me a warrant. I when does it, you think you license. fixed your license? I, I fixed my license. You should know me, man. I've dealt with you for years and years and years and years and years because I never could get my license, but I have my license for once within the last 10 years. You're going to give me a warrant? Sir, your license wasn't even eligible to be unsuspended. Do you want me to bring it in right now? Till the 20th eligible. of September. Sir, I promise you I have a license. I'm trying to explain this to you. The only reason I lost my license was due to the insurance that I, I had a mishap with them. So then I called them. I re-got my insurance, which is SR22 insurance. That is a liability insurance for a driver. I'm getting sued through but a listen law firm. To me. Here's what I'm asking you. When is it you went and fixed your license? The day after I got that ticket. Legitly, the day after. After this ticket that we're talking about right here? 8, 8 27, 2024 is when I got my first one issued, but I must obtain the special insurance in order to keep my license. That insurance, they said I didn't fill out paperwork and sent it in, but I had the paperwork in front of me. But I fixed that the day after getting that ticket. That's the only reason it was suspended was because of the insurance drop. But I legitimately got it within 24 hours after getting that ticket. And then the restrictions. What, you get, what, what it was your restrictions you're in violation of this month on the 9th? Nothing. I even took that ticket into the Secretary of State the day after I got the uh, driving on a restricted. I took that and because I'm tired, I'm tired. I, I pay three hundred dollars a month to keep my license, and I keep getting I keep getting harassed by the police officers because in their system it just says restricted and it does not give any restrictions. So I went to the Secretary of State the All day right. after getting driving on restricted, and they Listen, told me the only restriction I have Mr. is Reed. that I must. Mister Reed, I'm going to give you a chance because the other thing is you don't ever have insurance. But for you to get your license back from Secretary of State, even though you didn't have insurance in February of this year, you must have it now or they wouldn't have given you your license back. So you're telling me you yeah. have insurance? Yes, there's insurance on every vehicle I drive and I have All a right. license. I'll so tell you what, you send, proof you. That you, are, you send proof that you have insurance in by close of business today and I won't put it a warrant out. We'll leave it at a PR bond.
Well, my SR22 insurance is non-driver SR22 insurance. I'll bring that paper in too, because that's like my personal insurance for me. But I am eligible to drive anybody's vehicle that's not registered in my name. So it's in my wife's name, but there is insurance on every vehicle I drive. But I'll bring you this insurance paper too, the SR22 that covers me for anybody's vehicle. So you need to send it in by five o'clock or you're gonna get issued a warrant. You understand that? I don't I don't have no way to send nothing in. Can I just bring it in? You can text a picture of it. It should be so in the car that? with you, right? So, so yeah, yeah, it's somewhere in this mess because once again, I've been. Uh, All right, then you have almost two hours to find it in your car, take a picture of it, and text it to the district court. Where Where do I text it to? Okay, listen to me. Uh, right on your notice to appear today is the phone number for the district court six seven three zero four hundred. And they will give you either an email address where you can send a photo of that in or text it in to them. I'm giving you an opportunity. Right? I know, but I, it's the fact that you sat there and went straight to warrant, dude. And I worked so fucking hard to get my fucking license. All you guys want to do is keep fucking harassing me. I'm just going to say fuck it and give it up, dude, because you guys keep bringing me in court and harassing me when I fucking ask. Mr. It. Reed. This is like the tenth time you've been caught driving while your license is suspended or revoked. After ten years, I finally got my license, and ain't shit changed with you guys. I'm still in court, even though I got my license. All right. Well, you know what to do. All right. We're all set for today. You'll get another uh, court date in the mail. So just the court number. insurance in. Just the court number. That's all I got to do is just text it to the court number. I mean, I'm going to screenshot everything I do because I don't know how to do this. I've never done this, dude. Because once again, I've never had my license before. I don't know how that's supposed to make, make me feel sorry for you. You've I don't just been driving around for 10 years, right. even though you're not supposed to be driving around for 10 years. I mean, I got right? a family. What am I supposed to do? Just let them live on the streets? I mean, I mean it is what it no, is. No, sir. You're supposed to follow the law like everyone else. And when you don't, you get in trouble for it, right? And I've handled it every and I've handled it every time, but I don't deserve this one. And that's the only reason I'm getting so fucking pissed. I, I'm sorry for my language. All I right. seriously put ten thousand hey, dollars. Mr. Reed, Mr. Reed, I'll make another deal with you. I see a whole bunch of criminal offenses in your record here. And you said you've dealt with it every time. I got a bad feeling that when I run your name, you owe the court a lot of money and haven't paid off these going back till 2016, 2010. But you're telling me you took care of it every time so you don't owe the court a bunch of money on a bunch of files? No, I meant like I took care of everything to get my license. But yes, I, I pay you guys 40 bucks a month. Okay. So you don't, so you're, you try to take care of it, but you really haven't. No, no, I, I literally you have. You just I rack have up more and more money that you owe the court every time you get caught, right? No, I pay $40 a month like I have been. I mean, I, I've had an agreement with you guys for like three years now that I've paid. I, I don't <laughs> Sir, you would owe thousands of dollars to court. $40 a month might is not really that. making much of a dent in it. And then you just keep driving. Because the time before this was February of this year. You were driving without insurance when you weren't supposed to be driving, right? At what, when? February what? You owe $5,777 to the court for unpaid traffic matters going back to 2018. <laughs> and you're vaping in court as you sit in the driver's seat of your car for a driving well license. I have a license. I have a license. Yes, I'm sitting in the driver's seat of my car because I have a license. Sir, it was listen to me. I'm going to explain this. I'm going to explain this to you as easily as I can. You have a license, right? Yes. When the Secretary of State finds out about the ticket that we are here on today, guess what they're going to do to your license? I mean, I'm going to come talk to the prosecuting attorney and get it solved. So, I mean, at the end of the day. They're going to suspend you all over again. 
not if I take care of it with you guys, not if I plead it down to where I don't get my license suspended because I've never had my license before and I'm actually trying to do the right thing for once. You just keep harassing me. They man. already did that for you in February, permitting another person to drive. Matter of fact, they did that in 2020 and in 2019 and in 2018. Those are all the times the prosecutor gave you a break and lied and said you were permitting someone else to drive beside you. And I never asked them to do that. They offered that to me. I never asked them. I never asked them for anything. They really offered it to me. I'm, I'm literally asking because I'm actually trying to do the right thing for once. You know what I mean? But, but that, that's for another day. Uh, all right, sir. We're, we're all set for today. You know what to do. It's 730 yes. yes, but you can't text to that number. You call that number. They're going to give you an email address. I believe it okay, that's is... What I was district court at allegancounty.org but i don't want to go well i'm getting the nod that that is it you can text a picture of of it to the email district court at allegancounty.org all right all right i'll set then we're gonna let you go we're gonna do